Now, I talked to a guy the other day, and he said, yeah, I can only onboard one to two clients a month. Turns out, he's working with hedge funds, right? Which I know you want to kind of work with, right? So he's working with hedge funds, but he's doing like, he's basically like an admin, right? He was doing some of the HR docs, right? Doing the payroll. You know, he had a lot of people, he was like, he literally would go on site multiple days a week. And so a lot of you guys, if you cannot onboard more than one person, it's either a scope issue or a pricing issue, it's probably both, okay? So we'll talk a lot about that this weekend. And you know, one of the biggest things when you talk about this sales script and the sales process is standing up for yourself and getting a little cattle prod or one of those little whips and getting them to work on your terms and not committing to bullshit that you think you need to do because you don't know that you're actually providing value. So many people in this room I've seen, you're actually providing value. You're just not aware of it in your own mind. You haven't defined it in your own mind. You haven't communicated it to the client. So you're not willing to say, I'm not working on site. Or I'm not going to do these extra reports. Or I'm not going to manage the bookkeeper. Or I'm not going to take on the AP. Or whatever the case may be. 